Hi guys, what's up, Jason here, and welcome back to a brand new FIFA 18 player review on my channel. And in today's video, guys, I'm going to be reviewing 82 rated Footmas Andrea Pirlo. So, if you do want to go and get this card, you will have to complete the weekly objective of completing three lob through ball passes in online single matches. So, in my previous Footmas review, a lot of people asked how to get to online single matches. So, all that you need to do, you need to go over to the online tab scroll down to the bottom right corner and then you will see a thing that says online single matches so you just go into that press search for an opponent and then just like online seasons or foot champions you will find your opponent and go straight into the match so that is how you complete this card so getting to this guy's first pro now what is his long passing now this guy's passing in general is just absolutely insane um long passing you know short passing through balls he's just passing in general was absolutely crazy and he's one of the best passers on the game in my opinion um, I've decided to include not just goals in this review because I think it's going to be pretty hard to get, you know, um, quite a lot of um, quite a lot of goals with Andrea Pirlo just because he is a centre mid um, with not the best shooting stats to be honest. He has a 73 shooting. I did actually apply the Masterio or Maestro Hunter Cam style to him, what also helps to improve his shooting a bit. Um, as you'll see there, we do manage to get one goal there, um, a really nice long shot into the top corner there, and especially it showed off his curve there, what is another one of his pros, the goal, he didn't even try and save that, you know, the way the ball just curved in the air past the goalkeeper there was really nice. Um, so yeah, that is his next pro, his curve, and then the final pro I got to on with this card was his control. Um, this guy's control was incredible, you know, you played the ball to his feet, it would perfectly take a good touch, and then either take the shot or play it on um, to another player. Um, now getting into the cons, this guy did have quite a few cons, I couldn't actually fit all the cons into um, that little section there, as you can see on your screen. So the first con with him was his strength, now I think this is to do um, mainly with his height as well. This guy's only, I think he's around 5 foot 8, 5 foot 9, so he's not very tall, so we just get pushed around and bullied a lot in midfield. So that's one thing you will have to... Um, um, get used to when playing with this card and then the final um, con what is probably the biggest con with this card and that is this guy's stamina is absolutely horrific um, around half time usually I just had to sub him off just because his stamina was that bad um, some matches he did last to around the 60 to 70th minute mark um, you know if I didn't like run around with him a lot in the match but mostly I would say this guy you either use him as a super sub or just playing for the first half of the match and then you will have to sub him off just because his stamina is that bad. So getting into this chance there, he gets a really nice assist there. A player threw ball to Zlatan and then he finishes it very nicely. And I actually made a Zlatan Ibrahimovic footmas review yesterday. If you do want to go and check that video out, I'll leave a card to it in the top right corner at the moment. I'm sorry, right now. And then the next goal here, we run past everyone with Andrea Pirlo, and then we score a really, really nice goal there. Um, surprisingly, he actually beat quite a few players there using his pace, even though he doesn't really have much pace, um, but that was probably, you know, an odd occasion. But anyway, guys, this has been the review. If you have enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.